Hello friends, Shurma here. A very warm welcome to my channel and I'm glad you chose to stop by. It's a bright afternoon today and it's best to paint some peppy poppies on such a lovely day. The materials needed are listed over here. I start with the Canson watercolour paper which is 7.7 cm by 11 cm in size bottom of the paper has the same shape as the white paper lace. Here is the palette for the poppies. I have crimson, black and acrylic white on my palette along with flat brush number 6. I have loaded the brush and now I am blending the colors well. These are the poppies in the making. Poppies are very brightly colored red flowers and they are very open. So you can see the center of the flower very clearly. They have broad and white petals. And the petals are few. There you can see the center of the flower being created. These are the outer petals. Whenever you would like to add some highlights to the petal, you should always use more of white. I always prefer to redo the petals till I am happy with the result. It's time to paint the leaves. Now the leaf palette consists of bamboo and deep green as well as white acrylic and I'm using flat brush number 6. After loading the colors, it is extremely important to blend the colors well. Here I'm painting the large leaves. If you would like to refresh your leaf skills or just would like to practice the leaf strokes then it would be a good idea to visit my past videos. I will drop the links of those videos in the description box below. The poppy leaves have very spiky edges. So when you slide the brush away from the midline it should end in a point every time that will suggest the spikes you might notice that while painting that particular leaf I have covered the side poppy with a scratch paper that is to avoid spoiling it Did you see that? Yes, that is how you suggest the leaf which is turned towards itself. It's time for the center of the flower again. Here I am trying to show some pollen with the help of bamboo and deep green acrylic colors. And I am using a liner brush for making those little dots. That's a bit of white 
which I've added to highlight the center part. Once the painted panel is ready, it's time to assemble the card. I have an aqua green card base which is 7.7 cm by 11.5 cm in size. Firstly, I attach the paper lace to the bottom of the painted panel and then mount it on the aqua green base and I round it off with a sentiment. Now our Peppy Poppy card is ready. Hope you enjoyed today's poppy tutorial in one stroke style of painting. We'll be back soon. Bye bye.